you wonderful people. So for today's video, I want to talk about some news that came out recently. I want to say it's the head of Showtime ended up saying that they are actively working on potentially some more stuff in the Dexter franchise, which I thought was so interesting because I was wondering like whether or not Dexter was going to be like Dexter New Blood specifically was going to be a um, limited series. And it seems like it is. It didn't because I the way it would end it. You're like, OK, I don't see there necessarily being a season two. I should also preface this by being like there are going to be uh, spoilers for Dexter New Blood. If you haven't seen it, that being the continuation of Dexter. Uh, so you have been warned, but considering how Dexter New Blood ends with Dexter dying, I don't, I was, I thought that was so interesting news wise to hear that because I guess like it was so, I mean, I know some people didn't like it, but it must've been generally well received enough that they're like, oh, we want to do more in this franchise because it is a franchise that yes, people have had peaks and valleys with it in some extent, but you know, so, but they must have been really happy about its performance, uh, so that they're happy to kind of continue, because it's, it's a franchise that people probably, like, thoroughly enjoy, so, but having Dexter being dead, like, how do you continue that, because I feel like they set up, they made a whole point that Harrison isn't like his father, but maybe that is going to be where you continue, because I was like, you could continue with Harrison's story, but Harrison isn't like his dad, so maybe you find him wandering from place to place, because all of his family's gone, uh, his biological mom's dead, his uh, his stepmother dead, his biological dad dead, so he ended up leaving everything behind that he started building for himself with his dad, so um, you could see him like wander from place to place, and maybe the thing is, despite him, you know, being nothing like his father, it is too ingrained in him now after everything, after, um, after what happened to Rita, plus now killing his own father, that it shifted something inside of him. I mean, like, the sad thing is, I mean, Dexter's been down that route before, to some extent. I mean, he did kill his own brother, so... And, I mean, to be fair, he also killed Deborah too, at the very least, took her off life support while she was, like, when she was in the state that she was in. So it's like, obviously, doing something like that will mess you up. Like, he was doing the right thing, like, Dexter needed to be put down. But not, but part of me wonders, could, if we did follow Harrison going forward, because I'd assume we would, I don't think they do a prequel, do you? I don't think they would, because they've done enough of that in the original show. We got peeks into his past. Like, we never got, like... I don't think it was ever, like, anything fully dedicated. So I don't see that. I would assume anything going forward would be future stuff. And you'd assume it center around Harrison. Uh, I, won't th I wouldn't expect him to go, like, super far in the future. All of a sudden, like, Harrison's older and he's got a child of his own having to deal with similar circumstances. Harry had to deal with when it came to Dexter and stuff, you know? So, but, like, I think that'd be interesting if... You, if we did continue with Harrison, that basically he'd see Dexter just like he saw, uh, just like Dexter saw Harry and Deborah. But the thing is, he has bit mem like memories of his dad, but he didn't know his dad that well. He didn't spend that much time with his dad now that he was older. So that'd be interesting thing. It'd just be obviously a projection, obviously, of like... Um, him, you know, but it's like at least the people that Dexter saw were people he knew super well that knew him super well Whether it be his father or whether it be his sister like they they are the two people in the world who knew him best So it made sense for Harrison his dad was almost a stranger to him to some extent But maybe they can manifest that as, as oh This is the Dexter that Harrison as a kid remembers versus Harrison who's a teenager now the one that had to kill his dad with the dark side and how much time they spent together so maybe you can do the very angel and devil on your shoulder just because I mean to be fair like Deborah was always kind of sort of the angel more so the angel on his shoulder and so was but Harry I feel like played both because he played like oh I try to be your good nature side while also hey let's balance out your like demon your bad side like Deborah was all about no 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 be good be good be good she was all more angel I feel like Harry was a little bit of both angel and devil on uh, Dexter's shoulder, so kind of bringing that full circle to some extent with, like, two Dexters, like, rummaging through Harrison's mind. I don't know. Like, I, I, I don't know if you, you put that in a central location like you did, like, you know, the original series and even New Blood. I'd assume you would, but I'd just be so curious. Once again, I'm, I'm doing all this out here just it's speculation because nothing's confirmed. They're talking about the fact is they are actively working on stuff, but nothing's guaranteed. This is just something that could be like, oh, maybe maybe something does eventually happen of it. Maybe something never does. But, you know, it's just an interesting thought. Because uh, I talked about this when I uh, with the uh, uh, finale of Dexter New Blood that I was like, 
I, I could see them continuing things, but I'd assume they wouldn't because they're no longer following Dexter. And once again, Harrison is nothing like his father, but it's like, right, you think that, but considering everything that you've been through, that trauma, it stays with you, that anger that's inside of you. You're not like your father. You don't have his proclivities, but maybe somewhere inside of you, that dark passenger does exist to some extent, or maybe it has manifested now after everything that you've lost that you become a little more like your father, but struggling to be nothing like your father, you know, that that in itself is an interesting enough story that I could see you kind of continuing down that route. But once again, pure speculation on my part. Obviously, these are just some of my thoughts. I'd love to get to know yours in the comments down below. Would you like to see more of Dexter? What were your thoughts on Dexter New Blood? Did you like it? Did you not? I know some. I, someone had hit me up saying that they super didn't like it and they had heard from other people who didn't like it, but I thoroughly enjoyed New Blood. I thought it was nice and uh, interesting. I'm also someone that didn't like have an issue with the later parts of Dexter because I talked about it. I'd seen the final season for the first time prior to New Blood coming out because I'd never seen, I'd only seen like half of the first episode of the final season when it was originally airing. So, so I didn't have the issue with it the other way other people did, but regardless, just let me know all your thoughts in the comments down below. But really, that's all I'm going to talk about to the next time we meet. Be happy, be safe, we we'll like to the fullest and enjoy it. Good day and goodbye.